Welcome guys, welcome to my YouTube channel guys. So today we're gonna to be talking about Trader Central Fund. I know you guys wanna know if I try to pass the verification or not. So before we even start, please subscribe and punch a like button. Let's get into it. So I actually do pass the verification. Um, then I send a message to um, Trader Central team. I was like, hey, I passed the verification, stuff like that, all right? It actually take around five to eight business days before they reply back to me. I was like, whoa, that's a lot of time. I don't got time. <laughs> I'm gonna miss a lot of trades. <laughs> so they actually replied back to me and they told me that I did not pass because I was I was over whisking, I was using big lot size, I was not consistent and that's all true don't get me wrong that was all true because I was because I was using big load size like sometimes I was down some you know like I'm down like one two percent and I was risking huge lot size to bring the money back because sometimes I scalp you know um, I scalp and sometimes I switch to day trading you know if I'm in profit, I take my time, you know, but if I start going down, 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 then I'll try to scalp so I can bring the money back up. All right. And before I even start the challenge or before I even start the verification, I actually ask them, I actually um, contact the team just to clear, clear some, you know, misunderstanding because I have some question about the lot size and the team reply back to me and say, no. The, um, the lot size rules does not reply to the challenge or the verification. It only replies to the funding account. So I was like, okay, fine. I can go crazy on the verification. I'm trying to pass the verification real quick. And to be honest, I really don't care about Trader Central Fund, the accounts, because I don't, at the time, I don't feel like I can trust them. So my, I was just trying to pass the accounts real quick and just move forward, right? And luckily, I passed the, the, the verification and they start send, they, they send this message to me that, oh, you know, your own consistent and they told me that you cannot use 0 0.1 lot size um, on your account. Like, because I passed the account like maybe real quick and I was using 0 0.1 lot size to pass the, to just trade the minimum trading days, you know. And they told me that I cannot use that. I just got to trade normal. And I already make my, my 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 percentage I'm supposed to make. So I wasn't gonna try to lose that, all right? So I was just gonna just open to 1% to the end. And they, they replied, they, they sent all this message, you're not consistent, so you know, this, that, then this, that. So um, I know you guys are wondering if Trader Central can be trusted or is Trader Central a scam? All right, let's get into it. So there's a lot of traders out there um, having the same issue um, some traders are not getting funded because of like um, maybe they did like group trading right um, they don't get funded because of cons um, they're, they're not consistent on the trade their lot size um, stuff like that and there's a lot of traders too who doesn't get paid the full profit let's say you pass the funded account luckily you pass the funded account there's some trader who don't let's say you make six hundred dollars right they're gonna pay you probably four hundred dollars and that's that's too an issue right so another issue i have with them was i was having a monthly account with them because i was trying different things with them so i used to have a monthly account and i was risking um basically I have, they have um a lot size they have some kind of a minimum lot size you can use in different types of um, currency like gbp jpy maybe you can only risk 0 0.80 you know lot size um so I was risking, I was up 1% and all of a sudden my account stopped showing on my website. So I was like, wait a minute. Hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. <laughs> wait a minute, all right, my account stopped showing on my website. So I contact them and stuff like that. They said they're gonna send it back. Take some days and I never see my account, all right? I don't know if they send it back already, but I just closed my account, I don't care because I feel like I can't trust them, so I kind of just build it to my account because I create a specific email just because of I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try new um, new platform, but I feel like don't do it. Um, I would say 
start with FTMO, alright, go with FTMO, FTMO is the best, they're not going to trick you, the rules is out there, you can see everything, right, and go with FTMO, go to FTMO till you have the max um, prop from accounts, right, Get go with FTMO till you have 400k prop from account, then you can move to another um, platform. All right, I know um, Trader Central is cheap, and I know um, you know it's cheap. It's basically cheap. Three hundred to four hundred dollars for two hundred K account. Everybody wants that, so that's the trick they're gonna use against you. They're gonna um, give you a cheap stuff, and they're gonna make it really difficult for you to pass their account. All right, so most of the times you're gonna spend all day trying to read their rules, trying to read their the Q and A, everything, right? And at the end of the day, you feel like you know everything, but when it comes down to getting funded, they're not gonna fund you. They're gonna try and be like, hey, you're not consistent, but like, God damn, you never put it in the rules. Hey, you work skin over um, zero point this lot. So stick with the good platform before you move to any other platform. All right. So that's that's it, guys. So please subscribe, bunch of likes, buddy. Peace out.